Interested in trying out Helium Mobile? Use my promo code shown here to get your first month for free. That's right. For free. First month. Try them out. And then that way, you can test out the services. You get unlimited talk, text, data, and you can earn crypto as you map services, which can go towards paying your bill, making your bill basically free. So if you want to give it a shot, again, use my promo code. Hey, how's it going, everybody? So did you guys catch the update to Google Messages? If you didn't, let me show you guys. It's not the biggest uh, update to Google Messages, but something that I think we kind of wanted from a previous kind of old iteration of Google slash Android Messages. And that is actually dictating the color theme in your Google Messages app. And it's pretty easy to do. Um, I'll show you guys with my visible line here. But to um, to set the theme, as you guys can see that I have it as a, like a blue color, all you would do is just tap the three dots at the top right there and hit change colors. And now you can see the different options you have. Um, so with these options, you have a red version, a darker blue, kind of a like teal turquoise color purple, green, orange, maroonish kind of, or like a faded pink, a more defined pink, and then gray. So you have these options. I'm going to switch it over and make it orange and confirm. And now this thread has the orange theme and it's specific to the message thread. So you can see there it says I changed the theme on that. So let me go to my brother's uh, message thread right there. You can see his is a different color and I can actually switch his and make his blue. So we'll go with blue and we'll confirm. Now his messages are blue. So I'll go back to my visible line and you guys can see of an orange scent or orange accent and then to my brother's line, blue. So now you have the ability to govern um, your message like theme. And I guess uh, one of the reasons why I wanted this kind of back in Google Messages is because besides the fact of reading, you know, who the contact is that I'm messaging, sometimes I like to color uh, assign somebody's message thread so then I can, you know, double the confirmation that I'm texting the right person. So like, you know, for my wife, hers will be pink. That's like her favorite color. So like if I open the message thread and I'm typing a message that's meant for my wife, I don't really have to worry too much about somebody else receiving that message because she's assigned to pink so like messages that i don't text quite often those will stay the default um material uui theme color um only the ones with specific color assignments i know are people that are that i normally text and then the color obviously is going to tell me who i'm messaging besides reading the contact name at the top I know you could just read the name, but sometimes we're like so caught up in what we're doing that we just do a quick glance, type, or we just tap voice to text, say what we're saying, and then send message, not realizing that we're texting the wrong person. So I like that it's back in Android messages. But yeah, quick video on that. Let me know what your guys' thoughts are in the comments. Thanks for checking out today's video. And again, um, talk to y'all later.